This is the solution to written homework 18. Okay, expressed as a single fraction. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to say, okay, this is 7 over x plus 5. And what we want is we want to obtain a common denominator with this x plus 5 and this x plus 3. So this one, this denominator is missing an x plus 3. So if I, if I put the missing x plus 3 here, then I must also put another x plus 3 here. And then minus 6 over x plus 3. So in the same way that this first term was missing an, an x plus 3 in its denominator, this one is missing an x plus 5 in its denominator. But now these two have the same denominator, so we can proceed. So multiplying this out, this would be 7x uh, plus 21 over x plus 5 times x plus 3 and then minus 6x plus 30 over x plus 3 times x plus 5. So now we can combine them into a single fraction. <coughs> So this will be all over x plus 5 times x plus 3. And then this will be 7x plus 21 minus 6x plus 30. So if you stop here, this will be incorrect because these numerators need to be parenthesized. So these red parentheses I just added didn't change anything at all. But these green parentheses do change something because now it's saying subtract 30, whereas before it was saying add 30. So we're carrying this out. <coughs> 7x minus 6x, well that's x, and then 21 minus 30 is uh, negative 9, so x minus 9 over x plus 5 times x plus 3. For part B, this particular uh, quadratic doesn't factor, so that means that we'll do a very similar procedure to above. We'll say that, okay, this, this one is missing an x plus 2 in its denominator. So we'll say x plus 2 and then x plus 2 also in the numerator so that we have multiplied by 1. <coughs> and then minus 1 over... <clears throat> x plus 2, and by analogy to this term missing x plus 2 in its denominator, this one is missing x squared plus 1. So then now, let's multiply and collect. So this, <clears throat> uh, 
we need to uh, multiply out with FOIL, so that would be 2x times x is 2x squared, and then plus 4x uh, minus 4x minus 8 over x squared plus 1 times x plus 2 and then minus x squared plus 1 over x plus 2 times x squared plus 1. Okay. So that will be 2x squared uh, minus 8 and then minus x squared plus 1 over x squared plus 1 times x plus 2. Again, the parentheses are necessary to have the correct meaning. So that's 2x squared minus 1x squared, that'd be x squared, and then negative 8 minus 1 is negative 9 over x squared plus 1 times x plus 2, and then the instructions say by factoring, so that particular quadratic can be factored into x plus 3 times x minus 3 and then divide by x squared plus 1 times x plus 2 and no further cancellation is possible. <coughs>